models of all time, one of the most famous super sports illustrated models of all times has brought us one of the most beautiful collections. It's an HSN exclusive collection mm -hmm. you can't find anywhere else. I've got three different styles we're gonna share with you tonight. We're gonna start with the London Faux Leather Trench. It's on sale, it's with free shipping. Laura's wearing the olive, also comes in this fabulous caramel, and we have it in the red, which is the current, and we have it in black. 35 inches is the length, extra small through 3X, Already very popular, just launched. I'm so glad everyone can take a look at it in the show today. Laura, this is so beautiful. I, and the touch, the feel of it is so one incredibly on. soft too. That's what I think is really important about this. A lot of times when you hear something that says faux leather, you, we like it because it's affordable and it's easier to maintain and take care of, but it doesn't always look great. The thing about Kathy Ireland is she makes sure that every time she's bringing you something, it's actually looking really high quality. You would have no idea this is a $100 bill. This looks like it's several hundred dollars. I've even seen some lambskin jackets out there that are in the thousands of dollars. And that's what this feels like because it's so soft, it's so supple, and it's really smooth to the touch as well. You can see this gorgeous collar here with the notch that we have. And then it has this faux flap just to give it a little bit extra drama and flair that goes right underneath the collar. It's open across the front. It has two zippers on either side. These actually have nice deep pockets inside of them here, which is really nice. So you can put some tissues, you can put your keys, you can put a cell phone. You can see my entire hand fits all the way down in there. So if you need a little extra warmth, you can do that as well. And of course there's decor on both the sleeve and on the shoulder here at the top too. So done really well. Um, across the back, it has these beautiful princess seams for great figure flattering and a little bit of a slit here to make it easy as you walk and as you sit too. Oh, I love it. It's mm -hmm. fully lined. Look at how Completely. gorgeous this is. I just put this on and this is the first time I'm wearing this. I'm like, whoa. When you said it feels like faux leather, it feels like lamb. Yes. It really does. It looks like lamb. It's so smart. It's beautifully tailored. It is gorgeously tailored. It really I mean, is. I think that's one of the things because, you know, you mentioned Kathy was in Sports Illustrated. She was on 13 covers in a row, actually. She sold more sp of Sports Illustrated with her on the cover than any other model ever in history. But she also was in Cosmopolitan. She was in Vogue. She was in the, on the cover of Forbes magazine. So with all of that, she understands quality and tailoring for a woman's body, right? And that's one thing that she really tried to make sure to focus on. She wanted to make sure that as we put this on, we not only looked beautiful, but felt comfortable and beautiful in it. So even the way that the arms are cut give you plenty of movement when you're able to do that, but yet it's still figure flattering. The way the seams are done, they're done so precisely and beautifully, you'll never see a flaw in them. And then as you mentioned, it's lined on the inside as well. So it gives you that extra just layer of comfort and protection as you put it on and it glides over. It could easily be worn as, I think up north, this would be considered maybe a fall coat, right? For us in Florida, for people further in the south, this is a winter coat for most of us for the th more throughout <laughs> the year as well, right? But it could be a third piece. You could use it as a trench or as that London coat that just gets a little bit of European so inspiration. cute. And I love the length. It's that perfect kind of mm -hmm. car coat length. It's not too long. It's not too short. It's going to break the wind and keep you warm. But yet it's not too much. It's not an overly puffy or poofy coat. It's not going to be too heavy. It's very lightweight. It's kind of like this easy breezy kind of throw on and go style. I also love how soft it is. I love that it has a little bit of stretch. It's very forgiving, but it is a really sharp looking coat. Let's talk about how the models are wearing it. I threw on the color that we're calling, is it caramel? I don't know what that color is. Uh, I'll double check. It is camel. I was close. One letter off. It's camel. I love you in the olive. I love the uh, olive. That's I think so it's... pretty. I mm -hmm. just, I just love that shade. It's really unique. And then we also have in the current as well as the black. Let me check. We still have all sizes. Extra small through three X. I threw on the small, which was on the rack. Uh, I could also wear the extra you small. Uh, one thing to note is you don't have to worry about any closures in the front. It just kind of, it, you'll almost wear this like a duster or like a long sweater, right? Or a topper, yes. You know, yeah. that third piece that you could use. You really can make this part of your, your outfit for the evening too. That's what's really nice about it. So it is that. If you do want to belt it, I'm sure you have a gorgeous belt at home. You can just take it, close it, and belt it as well. I like that you mentioned you're in the small. I'm in the small also. Yeah. And so it really is one of those things that is just, I would probably put you in an extra small because you're so tiny, Sarah, that normally we would put you in that. But it works for you in the, in yeah, the small too. Especially over like a chunky sweater. Like chunky 
sweater, which you have, or in the winter, if you want to do some more layering, that works very well. But if you want to make it more of just that third piece, you can do it that way too. So it is very nice to be able to have that. And the soft and the touch and the feel, I think, is what's so important about it because it doesn't have that faux leather feel. It doesn't have that sound. You know, like, yeah. you know, you have something it's not leather. crunchy. It's not crunchy. It's not shiny. It doesn't still... stick to each other under the arms. Yeah. You know, it's smooth. It's also um, very lightweight. Mm -hmm. uh, so not like hot and heavy like another.